back with an update. Changed a few things on the sale. Um, it's now a 16 plate sale. I have six hot plates. That's three negative, three positive. And I'm hitting it with 12 volts. I just started this thing about 10 minutes ago. And it's not even warmed up yet. And getting some pretty decent production. My electrolyte mixture is one teaspoon of sodium hydroxide to one gallon of distilled water. And It's not even warmed up yet, and I'm getting some pretty decent gas. Again, this is the modified Lowe's switch plate cell, and just wanted to update on the the change that I've made. have great lighting in here and this camera is not the best. Some soapy water. That would make a pretty loud boom if I lit that. <laughs> Don't think I'll be doing that in here. <laughs> I've resurrected my bubbler that I used on my wet cell some years back. I had this installed on my Nissan truck. This is back when I made the uh, the brute force type wet cell, and uh, I got the idea for it from um, Steve uh, D Elvis 11. I just basically followed his idea or his plans with that sale. It was a good sale. It's just used a lot of amps. <laughs> this one, I'm not sure what I'm drawing. I don't have an amp meter, but I do know that it, it can't be too awful high having just one teaspoon of sodium hydroxide to a gallon of distilled water. If I increase that, increase my amperage, I'd, of course, increase my output. But I just wanted to show that this is a pretty decent production for one teaspoon to a gallon. I don't have this bubbler filled very high. I've got my sight indicator here on the side. You probably can't see it because I'm using uh, it's got this lace inside the hood. It's, it's only filled up to about right there. It's actually below the uh, the output line. And it's just dropping back in. It's probably not the best thing. I'm not going to have anything any fire or anything close to it to cause a, any explosion or anything but it's from this point here up is completely full of gas right now and I'm pushing it off in my, my bubbler. Again I made this thing for roughly sixty bucks. All the parts and materials. Maybe a little bit more, a few more plates. I have more plates, but my original plan was a 21 plate sale, <clears throat> which I probably still will do. I just need one more neutral in between my hot plates and I can, I'll have 21 plates. But for now, I'm just, just experimenting and seeing what I have. And I'm 
pleased with what I have so far. Got to build me a torch yet. But uh, before I do that, I want to get all my ducks in a row and make sure that I have a good uh, gas output. Actually, great uh, gas output. <laughs> Alright, I've rambled enough. Hopefully I didn't bore you too much. Later.